Hello, good morning, guys. How are you doing? Earlier, we went to the optical shop, of course, with my husband. <laughs> Why are you smiling, Papi? Hmm? Say something about the video. What must I say? <laughs> Anything about the video that is showing now. So yeah, that's our house going to the mall, which is called Cavendish Square. Yeah, it's a small little mall in Claremont, Newlands area, very close to where we live. It's literally a three minute drive from home. As you can see, there's a lot of trees <laughs> left and right of the street that's why sometimes our wi-fi is not so good because of the trees actually that is not that's not a lot of trees day but the opposite way of our house there's a lot of trees and what do you call that that area that's all newlands yeah, we come to the traffic circle on your left. You will see Barris. This is a nice restaurant. And in front of you on the right is a coffee shop where we normally buy our morning coffee if we're out on the road early. Very nice coffee for very nice prices. <laughs> you mean expensive? <laughs> no, it's not that pricey. It's affordable actually. That is, let's say, um, 30 rand. Huh? If you're going to convert that in pesos, that's more than 100. So that's not bad. It's like a, a Starbucks coffee. But it's just the plain one, say. Eh? And, and there was silence. <laughs> front of us wow by the way our car is a silver Volkswagen a Volkswagen it's Volkswagen yeah but in the Philippines we call it Volkswagen Volkswagen mm. it's the same like Playboy <laughs> which means flavor by the way the in front you will see that's the mall it's got three stories very nice shops some expensive some not so expensive and um, there's always a lot of parking there here you will see us into the parking area we will have to drive inside the mall and it's called underground parking or covered parking as some people will call it the parking lot at divisoria is like this have you been there yeah you've been there right i've been to many places in the philippines and we miss home so um guys we will show you a lot of places here in Cape Town but since we're ha we have a lockdown we have minimal movements for some people not for me as <laughs> I'm an essential worker so that <laughs> is not applicable to me yeah since I'm jobless I'm just staying at home most of the times and that puppy uh, for the parking area for the parking area we're going up to um, if you would count it from the ground that will be first floor first floor of covered parking area so they have medium malls here in Cape Town it's a lot smaller compared to the malls that we have in the Philippines. 
only downside here of Cape Town, you can't find everything in one place. Mm, that's true. Unlike the Philippines. Everything is in one place. And aside from that, it's pricey here. I'm already avoiding um, like converting everything, but I can't stop it. Because it's very expensive here. the parking lot yes we're looking for parking and as you can see the, the red lights indicate the parking has been taken the green light shows the parking is available like this one <laughs> is available parking is fairly cheap for say about two hours you'll pay like five rand it's like Really, less than 20 pesos. Yes. For two hours. There's my wife. She's got her little mask on. <laughs> which is compulsory. Yes, it is compulsory here. I think everywhere. And you can see there's a lot of stars there. And we're making our way to the lift to go down to ground floor. But of course, there's not a lot of people in the mall. It's because of lockdown. Is it? Are we still on lockdown? Yes, we are still in lockdown. Yeah. And we decided otherwise. Yeah. Of course, sanitize, sanitize. We have to sanitize. I'm blocking the camera. I was blocking the camera. But usually, I mean, during the regular days, without the lockdown the parking lot is full no? usually usually yeah. especially this mall since it's the closest mall that's around in Claremont we've got another one but it's on the other side it will take about 10 15 minutes to get there it is a bit bigger and it's also got like four or five stories I miss SM Mega Mall. <laughs> I miss the SMs. I'm waiting for the left to the right so we can go down. Is it down? Yeah. As you can see, left, even in the left, there is social distancing. There's four places, only four people. Is allowed in the left at a time or two trolleys. See, guys, you don't need to travel just to see Cape Town. We're gonna show you a lot of Cape Town. Now we reach the ground floor. The optometrist, the spectacle shop, as you call it. By the way, Cape Town is in South, South Africa and I thought that animals are roaming around since it's Africa but yeah, my husband told me that Africa is Africa and South Africa is South Africa No animals roaming around You can see affordable eyewear, yeah, this is beautiful. prescription glasses, sunglasses, whatever type of glasses you're looking for, you'll find it in a shop like that. We just came to pick up a prescription sunglasses and we have to try to wait so she can try them on. To see mm -hmm. if they need to be adjusted or not. Yeah, and his eyeglasses unfortunately was not yet available. Again, it's because of the corona. But mine is already available because it's just for computer computer eyeglass. I need to get 
get me um what do you call that the one where you put the phone you still have that one yeah self selfie stick isn't it selfless stick <laughs> no problem yeah that's that's a purple one i i have um two i got me two eye glasses one is like leopard brown kind of thing and that other one is purple okay we just changed the music That's JC and Hobby. She can't avoid the dance. This is very really nice. It's my younger baby brother, Jason. He's just 21. She's so busy with the glasses, waiting because we have to go buy some clothing for Jason. We're waiting for her to finish up. Okay, I was already satisfied and I tried all the glasses and it fits very good but on our way out we saw his friend and then he mentioned to him that that his eye was painting so what happened puppy I had to sit down so they could have a look with it light into my eye to see if there's something maybe wrong with it yeah So there I'm sitting in that motorized <laughs> chair. Were you nervous when they were checking on you? No, I was not nervous at all. <laughs> the other music is very nice. <laughs> So I'm waiting for this lady to clean the machine, as you can see, sanitize, 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 <laughs> sanitize. Yeah. It's not part of our daily routine, daily lives. She's just wiping off the machine with sanitizer so it's not contaminated with any foreign objects or viruses, <laughs> bacteria, etc. And she moved this little machine in front of my eyes so she could see me. After the test, we walked to the shop. We were going to try and place some pieces of clothing. It was a long walk, but it was worth the work. <laughs> As you can see, no, it's not very really cool, unlike in the Philippines where everything is cool. After we picked up some items of clothing for you, we decided to get home. We're going to pass this evening. I 
The shop is just how many minutes away from us? Three? Five minutes. Five minutes. Hello. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.
Finally! For real!